Okay, Zalazane. Zalazane defeated Smokin. Yeah, I got his head in my pocket. Here you go. Look at that. Zalazane's head. I killed him twice. Two Zalazane heads. Uh, with Zalazane gone, our tribe can again sleep in peace. Thank you, Smokin. The Darkspear tribe owes you much. If you suffer from an ailment, visit my assistant Bombay behind me. His voodoo is strong. Um... What's he going to give us here? Uh, you got the choice of lightweight boots, which are for your feet, and, uh, and they're male armor. And they give you 70 armor and sell for 67 copper. We're not going to bother with it because uh, we can't wear male. And uh, these veiled grips that he gives us, which are, uh, which are for your hands and leather, uh, they offer us 33 armor, which is better than the currently equipped battle-worn leather gloves, which only offer 21 armor. So we're going to... Complete that quest after we choose a reward. We're gonna equip those gloves. There we go. The veiled grips. Um, we got another quest to turn in. Duratar Tiger Furs. And Valrin Fang. I remember my first tiger hunt smoking. I chose to hunt on the largest of the Echo Isles, and I sat perfectly still in the shadows of its foliage. Foliage. I don't know how to pronounce that word. Foliage for the for almost a full day, watching and waiting. My muscles were taut and I was ready to strike. It was one of my greatest victories when the tiger finally took the bait. Here's your uh, four tiger first, bud. I am pleased, Smokin. Because of your help, our people will be protected and not go cold as the seasons change. Thank you. It's all good, buddy. I am happy to be fucking out of here. All right, let's go talk to Bombay. Yeah, man, I be glad God rends assisting. This year, volunteer work be my way of getting through the witch doctor's school. Since you help him, I and I help you for free. What should be need fixing? Uh, we'll say we got low spirits. He's gonna voodoo us and do a toad. Ribbit. That's all good. Uh, what about a bad hangnail? Now we're a chicken. <laughs> these all last for th these hexes can last for twenty seconds, um, and you can't control yourself. But uh, you can right-click the hex and get rid of it. That's something that you'll uh, wish you could do inside Zulfarak. Now we're feeling underpowered. Oh, that's unreal. That's pretty sweet. He makes us giant. And that lasts for five minutes. I'm going to do that one again before I uh, hurt stone back. What if I got the jungle fever? Oh! Turn into a little snake. Or a big snake. Because uh, because we got grow on. <laughs> That's pretty sweet. Uh, I have a unibrow. <laughs> there you go. He gets you drunk. You feel strange. Uh, uh, this is what it looks like when you get drunk. No, it's just not bad YouTube graphics. Um, the vision gets all blurry, and uh, and you can't run in a straight line. And say you encounter an enemy, if there's any around. Oh fuck! Anyway, if if you were to look at an enemy, um, it would actually tell you that his level is uh, is a lot lower than what his level really is. So <laughs> it's it's kind of funny. You get drunk and you uh, you think you can take on a bit uh, more than you can chew. Uh, what about if you got whiplash? What does he do to you if you got whiplash? He turns you into a ghost. All right. Um, if your problem is that you don't want to go back to work. He'll get you drunk again. Wow. Oh, you fucking... So, okay, I guess it's uh, completely random. It doesn't do the same thing every time. It is completely random. You can get rid of the old special brew thing, too. Oh, there's that little ghostly buff. Uh, anyway, we're going to Hearthstone. Back to Razor Hill. And then we're going to turn and break a few eggs there. 
here we go. Glad to be at Ascension. I hate those Echo Isles quests. So here we are in uh, Razor Hill. Oh, and it's the uh, the old Feast of Winter Vale, or whatever. Cause it's almost Christmas time, right? What's his name? Cook Torka. Turn in, break a few eggs. Breakfast, lunch, dinner. Who cares which meal it is? It has to be me. Be cooked by someone, namely me. There you go. You might be weak, but at least you're not clumsy smoking. Here, take this and get out of my way. I've got cooking to do. All right. So he gives us a bunch more shit, and uh, what we're gonna do is sell it. I didn't introduce this girl in the uh, last week's episode, uh, so two weeks ago actually. Um, she's a stable master, and uh, you know she's important to hunters, but uh, without a pet, she's useless, and we don't have a pet right now. So I'll get into it some other time. So we're definitely gonna sell. All this useless junk. And, um, and yeah, that, uh, that makes quite a bit of room for us. Here in the inventory, we'll get rid of those linen cloths by converting them to linen bandages. Give us a total of nine, which probably won't be used. And, uh, and, you know, we got a fair amount of uh, stacks of uh, copper here. But, uh, but yeah, okay, that faintly glowing skull was the uh, quest reward for, uh, for Zalazane. And uh, what that does is it, uh, it's a one-use item. Um, and when you use it, it steals 75 to 125 life from a uh, target enemy. Uh, that actually scales as you level, so you could you could technically keep that again until level 80 or whatever, and uh, and it'll do massive amounts of damage if uh, if you know you stack uh, gear with uh, spell power. And um, and yeah, so say you're like a warlock or a mage, and you keep that until uh, way way later on and, and you can uh, use that and it'll uh, it'll steal uh, well it will it'll hit them for a lot of damage but it won't give you as much damage uh, or it won't heal as much damage as you uh, as it normally would to you um, but okay that was it for uh, for this episode we uh, our bag space is filling up um, and we got a uh, one more week before we uh, we hit Orgrimmar, but um, but next week we'll be doing this encroachment quest. We're gonna finish that one off, and uh, and we'll also be picking up a couple more up in uh, Northern Durtar, and um, and we'll meet our first goblin at the same time. We'll do one of his quests, and uh, and that's probably where we'll, we'll where we'll wrap it up, uh, because by then we should be level 10 and uh, and that 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 kicks off our uh, our level 10 as a hunter week where we do our, uh, our hunter quest and uh, we pick ourselves a pet we are going to introduce ourselves to Orgrimmar and we're also gonna pick up skinning and make more money we'll also yeah we're gonna put a bunch of shit in the auction house too so Next week we'll be killing more Quillbore and um, and picking up a couple more quests. Um, until then, guys, have a good Christmas. Merry Christmas. Um, have fun. It's Pete the Leet signing off for uh, how to own World of Warcraft. Peace. <laughs> In the middle of a leg spike.